What's up guys, it's Magic Alex here. By now you've probably heard about the new operating system for Android, Android 4.2 that's scheduled to be released with the Nexus 4 and the Nexus 10. Um, also we've heard that the OTA updates for the Galaxy Nexus and the Nexus 7 has been slowly trickling out to um, users of those devices. But if you're itching to get your hands on 4.2 and you, know, you live in a region where updates like this are typically slow well the good news is that you can actually manually flash 4.2 onto your Nexus 7 device um, I'm going to show you how to do this right now so first off we're going to need um, to in install the stock 4.1.2 onto your device um, by the way this is for rooted and custom ROMed users so if you're not rooted or custom ROMed I've put um, instructions in the description below as to how you can take an alternative route to flash it. It's easier than um, if you would root it. But if you're rooted, you do need to be back onto 4.1.2 and link in the description below uh, where you can download this file. And the second file you're going to need is the image for the actual 4.2 itself. So you're going to need to have 4.1.2 and then this 4.2 kind of upgrades from that 4.1.2. So once you've downloaded both those files, um, you can transfer it to your device using your favorite method. In this case, I'm transferring it using Android File Transfer um, to my device. And once you've done that, we will head over to flash it in recovery. In my case, I'm using Clockwork Mod. So as you can see, I now have both images copied over onto my Nexus 7 device. Let's go ahead and flash them. First off, let's reboot into recovery. And once you're in, the first thing you want to do is to wipe data, wipe cache, and wipe Dalvik cache to ensure the best possible transition to the new operating system. Once that's completed, navigate to the folder where you transferred the images and you're going to want to flash 4.1.2 first so flash stock 4.1.2 first a shout out here to Andrew2511 for having put together this really neat um, installer for the stock ROM you also want to enable root um, if you would like to keep it, um, I do highly recommend that you do it. So as soon as the installation is done, you will need to reboot into the fresh install just once. And once you're in, you can now set up your Google account. Just go ahead and sign into the account. Once the setup is complete, you will need to reboot once again into recovery. So power off and hold the volume up and down buttons and the power button at the same time to get back into recovery. Once in recovery, navigate again to the folder in which you had transferred the ROM and this time we will flash the 4.2 ROM. So there is no need to wipe data, wipe cache um, before doing this because we'd already done it. This is just an upgrade from the 4.1.2. So go ahead and flash the 4.2 ROM. So once that process is complete, you will want to reboot the system. So I'm going to select not to disable my recovery flash, but I do want to fix root. So I'm going to click fix root to keep root on the device and this should take us into 4.2 so after the requisite updating you will see the um, signature new lock screen widgets on 4.2 and of course jumping into settings into the about phone about tablet will show that we are indeed on 4.2 so I hope that was helpful, guys. Um, 
Don't forget to like the video, subscribe, leave a comment below about your experiences of flashing 4.2 in Nexus 7.